It is something very special indeed to make it to a UEFA Champions League final. Now these two teams are intent upon tasting glory. Welcome to the showpiece event on the European club calendar. Derek Ray here in the commentary position, joined tonight for live coverage by Stuart Robson. It's Paris Saint-Germain, and they take on Shakhtar Donetsk. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. And the PSG team looks like this. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Presnel Kimpembe plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Jorginho Wijnaldum starts alongside Marco Verratti in the engine room. And the main striker today is Kylian Mbappe. And they're underway now in the Champions League final. We're about to find out which team is the best in Europe. He's beaten his man. Crossing opportunity. Couldn't keep the ball. They're really pressing their opponents. Dagba. Well, who would be a defender when the responsibility is one of trying to shackle Neymar? At the moment, he's playing with great confidence. Every time he gets the ball, he looks though like he's going to score, as his record in recent times will suggest. Three goals in the last three games. He's been brilliant. He's got to get to that cross. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Oh, well, they have it again. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. He'll try his luck here. Well, from so far out, it didn't appear to be the high percentage option. Close, though, Stewart. Well, he did have options, but that was a good effort in the end. He wasn't too far away, was he? Verratti Neymar PSG couldn't keep it and giving it away might be able to get in behind the defence well it's ended up being quite frankly easy for the keeper well he should be hitting the back of the net that's a poor effort. Jorginho Wijnaldum. Verratti. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. But they dealt with the threat posed. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back.
Davi Neres. Can they forge ahead from this corner kick? Let's see. And well, they're going for the short one. And he takes on the shot. Body in the way. Corner once more. And short it is. Oh, it's off the woodwork. Well, what a good effort that was. He didn't have much to aim for, did he? So unlucky, really. Neymar. Seemed to switch off for a moment, and now a throw in. Promising looking attack. Can he give them the advantage? And it has arrived the opening statement in this UEFA Champions League final. Well, here it is again, and I don't expect goalkeepers to save everything at their near post, but on this occasion, although it's a good strike, he should do better. Now they get the ball moving again. What effect will that goal have on PSG? We're going to find out here. Paredes not a fantastic piece of defending was it really getting stuck in and Paris Saint-Germain with the ball again and the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Wijnaldum. There will be one minute added on at the end. Absolutely spot on and they keep the ball. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes. Into the second half, then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Neymar. Verratti. Is with Paredes. Well, he has the measure of his opponent. And they couldn't quite muster a real threat. And threading it forward. He's in behind the defence here. Can he find the net? And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. Mbappe. Neymar. Well, he likes to run at them. And a big moment because the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty coming up. And on the back of that decision, now it's a caution. Well, it's a tight call, but in the end, I think he's got it right. A penalty and a yellow card. And now to level the game. A goal! Calmly taken spot kick. Well, 
Well, as you can see from the replay, the keeper tries to read the penalty, but he's sent the wrong way, and it ends up looking a very easy finish. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Creative look about this. Can they forge ahead? Brilliantly blocked. Substitution it is for PSG. Playing it short. Firing it in. Now keeper getting both gloves on the ball. Well, the stats tell you everything. Their finishing just hasn't been good enough. They've controlled much of the game, but they need to start taking some of these opportunities. We're getting the ball forward. Teammates in the middle. Well, they haven't overcome all the difficulties. And that. Well, making high pressing work for them here. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. A very good tackle. To jump in front. Oh, it's in. They're in front here. Now can they stay in front? Well, here it is. 1v1 against the keeper, and the outcome was never really in doubt. He never looked like missing that. a big moment in the dying embers will it prove decisive here 20 minutes to go Verratti here's Mbappe good use of advantage in favour of PSG and smart defending how can he take them on and beat them A move of promise on the flank. And there's the feed into the box. Ah, goalkeeper's ball. Not the best of crosses, really, was it? And for more on the injury, let's go down to our reporter, Jeff Shreves. The feeling down here is he's twisted his knee. You can just see him testing it out every now and then. At the moment, though, he's carrying on. Oh, he's through here. Well, he... Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Wijnaldum. Verratti. Time is against PSG, but they still have the ability to hit back. Oh, a good diving save. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. Substitution it is for PSG. The delivery from Neymar. Oh, a goal! And the note. Goal at that. Well, not part of.
to the script, was it? Well, as you can see, it came off him last, and as a result, it will be an own goal. So unfortunate. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. On the offensive, is there to be late excitement? Can he put them in front? No is the answer to the question, and that could be so important at this stage. Well, will they get another chance? That would surely have won the game for them. And still looking for space. And played to the front post. Well, pretty straightforward for the keeper, you've got to say. That is that. So back in business here, the first period of extra time, and it might well come down to mental fortitude. Who wants this more? Still alive, and he clears it out of harm's way. He takes aim, putting his body on the line. Well, going for power from there, but not worrying the goalkeeper in the slightest. Idrissa Gay. Wijnaldum now. Clearly offside. Verratti. Here's Mbappe, Neymar, space and time for the cross, it's wholehearted defending and the concession of a corner here, substitution time it is here. Can someone get on the end of this? Not really the ideal clearance. And a fantastic diving save. And taken short. He got in the way of that cross. And he read it superbly. And the first period of extra time comes to an end. Well, the drama continues to unfold. Second period of extra time now. Chance to attack using wit. And delivered by Neymar here. And there the attack ends for now. Just not looking confident in possession. They're on the scent of a winner late in this game. Can they forge ahead? And it's in! What a moment near the end of this UEFA Champions! Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end.
Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. Well, a corner it is, and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. A delivery from Neymar. Growing pressure here, and another corner. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, he failed to get it away properly. Just can't get it past him. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Great block again. Mbappe. Now Messi. Trying to lob the keeper. Well, sadly for him, chipping it over the top. Well, that's a waste of a good opening. That's a really poor attempt. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. The cross is on. And there it is! Full time! They are the Champions League winners! Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. Here we go. The Champions League winners. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.